copyrighted from 1954, Silver Screen Classics. It was preceded by some kind of a warning about, it's called Treasure of the Incas or something like that. But they had to give some kind of a warning that we do not support, you know, treatment of whatever. I'm not seeing anything really bad, but with these warnings that they're giving, that's a warning for you. These, this is your grandparents' era, 1954, or your great-grandparents. If they turn you against everything that happened in your parents' generation and their other parents' generation, that means you might as well go back to the Stone Age because you're standing on who, who, what, who invented textiles, who invented plumbing, who invented um, penicillin, and all these things. If you're going to sit there and judge the times and have to give warnings to people as though they are stupid, even young people are not that stupid, but what you're doing is weaponizing the young against the old by all of these creepy, creepy warnings. This is what they did in China in 1966. They said, we're going to sweep away all the old bad stuff. So they killed off all of the old generation. I'm seeing exactly the same thing happening in North America on your television set. And it was a bloodbath. Now here, they're going to do it more subtly. It might not be a bloodbath. It might be just like, a, you know, everybody's just dying and some kind of, they're going to lie about how they're dying. But it's the same thing. You better wa wake up, people. You can't let these people encroach, encroach, just like a little a, a predator, just slowly seeing what they can get away with, pushing the envelope, insulting your own uh, judgment, making the choices for you, uh, you know, slanting your bias the way they want you to have it. And I don't care how old they are, or that it's all these young, judgy people that are judging everybody. They are sick. Uh, they take away all of the, the joie de vivre out of your life. They make it boring and flat. And uh, they, that's all that they can do. We have always grown up with offensive uh, things. But we understood that, that this is a context of life. Life is never clean and perfect and, and uh, you know, uh, nice and kind and polite. In fact, the more that they try to push it, the more the backlash is going to be. The more they try to control the way you think, the more, the more um, insipid and ugly you want to become. I mean, I shouldn't even have to see this. I shouldn't even have to read those fucking warnings. Who are they to tell me what to think? Who the hell are these people? Who gave birth to these people? is what I want to know. And when are you going to get rid of them? Why are they allowed to do that? That's an invasion of my mind. That's an invasion of my, my, my freedom of thought, my privacy, everything. They've already uh, did the universal fires. 